All right, Clint, uh, Cliff, 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 welcome to the St. Augustine's Asylum for the Mentally Ill. My producer, Tom, said good things about you. In your backpack is a flashlight, a voice recorder, an EMF, and a couple of little fun occult things. We'll let you know when to take those out. Ready to pay off some of those college debts and beer tabs? Well, of course you are. And when you're ready, enter in through those front doors. Nice, the door was unlocked. Ah, it can get a little sticky sometimes. So, here's the story behind the St. Augustine's Asylum for the Mentally Ill. It was founded in the 1880s, closed in the 1960s, and a lot of nasty stuff happened here. I mean, this place is only supposed to house around 500 patients, but at its peak, it was around 3,300 patients in here. I mean, the place was, you know, less of a hospital and more of a place where you dropped your problems off and hoped they disappeared.
Okay, the four areas you need to visit to fulfill your contract, the e-social area is the first on the list. This is the area where the inmates who are deemed a danger to society would convene. You'll go to this room and perform a summoning ceremony. So walk into the center and we will begin. Get out of this hallway and then take a take your second right. Door, door, damn it, damn it. Oh, okay, there's a there's a staircase. Take the staircase up to the second floor, and you should be next to a fire escape. You should be able to get out that way. So so go up the staircase. Staircase wasn't there before. This place doesn't even have a basement. What the 
What what is going on? All right, all right, just. I don't think you got any other choice. I think you gotta make your way downstairs.
can't use that anymore. Sorry. 